Hey guys, it's Miguel here and welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be taking a look at what I think is the definitive low-cost, load-bearing equipment that I think a new or even an experienced player should buy. Today we're taking a look at the Viper VX Buckle Up Utility Rig, a cost-effective modular option for both new and veteran players alike. This overview here is aimed primarily at new players looking for their first foray into load-bearing equipment. The first mistake I've seen new players make over the years, and I'll admit it, I've been one of them, is buying a cheap LA style assault vest. You've all seen these before and I can almost guarantee that 60% of the time you've bought one every time. The LA vest was the hot shit in the early 2000s, but like many of its counterparts, it is dead technology. That zipper up the front will get shot out. I know from experience, having had to sew many replacements into a shitload of vests over the years. Those pouches have flappy tops that are not removable and in some cases not quite wide enough to hold a 762 magazine. Sure you can fold the flaps over and insert the magazines that way but the minute you do some heroic shit that magazine will leave the building. These vests, especially the cross draw versions which will restrict your ability to carry magazines on the support side and replace that functionality with a barely usable dog shit holster are a waste of money and do more to hinder players than help them. For roughly the same cost as one of these vests, you can buy into a platform that is modular, well made and will grow with you as a player. The Viper VX Buckle Up Utility Rig is a loose copy of the Spirit of Systems Micro Fire Rig, which is THE go-to rig for the cool guy operators and flat range LARPers out there. In its stock form, it consists of a double decker pouch made from Kojura fabric in a variety of colours including black, green, colour to grey, VCAM and VCAM black. The two pouches are lined internally with loop velcro. The rear of the whole rig has hook velcro with a loop protector to stop that scritchy velcro from ruining your clothes. The front pouch has a full length flappy cover which is held in place in the rear compartment with velcro. On the outside of this flap is a strip of loop velcro in the matching pattern to the rig. The rig is held to your body with a hitch harness made from Kojura with a loop velcro ID panel on the back and one inch webbing matching the color of the rig. Around the waist is a 1 inch webbing belt. These are all held on with quick release buckles, hence the name the Buckle Up Utility Rig. The two large compartments when partnered with the inserts which are available in 9mm 5.56 and 7.62 can hold either 4 9mm magazines, 3 AR magazines or 2 big chungus magazines. This means as standard with two inserts you can carry 8 MP5 magazines, 6 AR magazines or 4 foul magazines which in airsoft is plenty of ammo for a reasonable game. To make the system even more modular, you can remove the full length flap entirely or swap it out for a half flap. On the lower section of the rig, you can add a dangler pouch, which Viper called the scrot. This attaches to the rear panel with Velcro and internally has space for three nine millimeter magazines, grenades or sneaky snacks. It is also an ideal place to store any in-game items such as medic bandages. If being able to carry 6 AR magazines is not enough, expansion wings are also available. These can be attached to the rear of the rig and sit beneath the straps, giving you two double columns of laser cut molly. The only issue I have with these is they have to go under the belts or they will flap about like a turd in the breeze. To solve this issue, I stitched 1 inch webbing loops onto the rear to allow the belts to feed through and they hold securely on the exterior of the rig. In regards to cost, the basic rig over at militaryfirst.com costs £28.50. The inserts cost between £5.50 and £6.50, the half flap is £9.45, the scrot is £10.95 and the expansion wings are £13.95. So for a full rig setup the same as the one I use with an MP5 insert, a half lap, a scroll, a double pistol pouch and the expansion wings, the price would be close to £80. But you don't need all of that to get out the door and running. Just a rig and a single insert that fits the flavour of magazines you run will cost you £35. And if you want to upgrade it in the future, all those extra things are still available and you can pick them up at any time and throw them on there. Or maybe you even want to run a plate carrier. The Viper VX Buckle Up is compatible. Just remove the hitch harness and belt from the mini rig and it clips straight onto the front of the plate carrier. With all that in mind, the Viper VX Buckle Up Utility Rig is in my opinion a no-brainer for a new player. It's simple, lightweight, 
well made, cost effective, and most importantly, it looks cool. So if you're out there now, looking at wish.com, thinking, I'll just buy this LA Assault vest for 15 quid, it'll be fine. Don't click that buy button. It's gonna take six weeks to get here and it's gonna be crap. Buy something that's gonna grow with you and help you become a better player. Because like the old saying goes, the best gear doesn't make a good player, but crap gear makes a good player absolutely dog shit. You can Google that, it's a true quote. I think some Special Forces guy said it. But I mean, at this point, what Airsoft is so basically Special Forces anyway, right? If you have any questions about the Viper VX Buckle Up Utility Rig, please go ahead and leave them down below. If you want to see more content like this, hit subscribe, hit the like button if this has been useful to you, or just hit dislike for the lols. If you want to watch more content like this, there is a playlist on the screen right now. Go ahead and click it. And remember kids, my name's Magaz, and the air may be soft, but our balls are hard.